Okay, so your next step is to know your machine, okay? Know what system you go and find out about system, system compatibility. Okay, to do this, again, we go to the Start button, right-click on Computer, and you go to Properties. Now, right here you can see, so I'm using a 64-bit machine on uh, i5, so which means I have a 4-core processor. It's recommended if you're going to use your computer to edit video, that you have a, a four core, you know, a quad core machine, okay? Uh, I also have, you know, available uh, memory to use. I have a 60 gigabytes. Now, if you're using a 32 bit machine, you're gonna be limited to uh, two gigabytes, even if you have a four gigabytes RAM installed on a, on a system. On a 30 -bit, 32 bit machine, you're always gonna be limited to the two gigabytes, okay? Now, with that said, you know, HD, HD Platinum 10 and the Sony Vegas Pro 10 and the Sony Vegas Pro 11, they all should work fine, okay? All you need to, to, to be worried about is about hard drive space more than anything because, you know, the guys created the program Sony Vegas and they know that on the 32-bit machines you are limited to the, to the 2 gigabytes even if you have a more memory, okay? Now, for these programs to work on any version, it's recommended that you use a four or quad core machine uh, quad core processors for video okay and a minimum uh, of at least you know two gigabytes obviously but if you can have more the more the better okay and our drives i go uh, eight uh, terabytes okay so i go uh, you know enough space in our drives here but there you go so this is the first step now all you need to do is simple choose your version where I'm going to show you how to solve rendering problems and crashing problems for each version. So I'm Zed Nunes. Please comment, rate, and subscribe, and share. Bye-bye for now.